Hello everyone and welcome to the GMS Magazine channel. I am Paco Garcia, your host, and this is the RPG A Day 2020 edition. A show devised by Mr. Dave Chapman, who decided it would be a great idea to talk about role-playing games every single day during the month of August. And since I agree, here I am. Today's prompt is dramatic. You know, this is something that an awful lot of people try to achieve in their games and is slightly simpler than it may seem. But there is one thing to be careful about, and it's that it's very easy to jump from dramatic to tragic. Which are really different things and different tools that you can use at very different times. And don't get me wrong, escalating the dramatic to the tragic is easy, but not always rewarding. To have drama, we need to have at least two very, very essential elements. One is risk. Without risk, there is no anticipation, there is no trepidation, there is no drama. And the second, and just as important, the potential of loss. Without risking losing something, there is no drama, there is no fear, there is no... Ah, moment. And those two things are absolutely essential. The thing is that they are also very easy to abuse and very easy to misuse. Adding drama to an adventure or a game session can be something very welcome, but also something that can ruin the mood. If you are having a light-hearted session and suddenly something super dramatic happens, it can be like, we didn't need that. Not today, maybe another time. On the other hand, it's also a fantastic tool, especially in one-offs, one-shots, to hook people. Because when good drama happens, people are going to be sitting at the edge of their seats. Seriously. It's a wonderful thing to see that something they're just discovering they could lose it and it is within their power to save it but they don't know if they will be able to when there is drama there is expectation there is a desire for something not to happen to avoid something and that is a wonderful tool just you know don't overuse it and think about whether sometimes people also mistake drama for shock. And even though shock value has some value in some places, it really isn't a replacement for good drama. Dramatic things have to be that. Dramatic. Like this video. So, thank you very much indeed for being there. Tomorrow, of course, there's going to be another video. So, until then, I will talk to you tomorrow. Take care.